Sapphire unveils Radeon RX 6900 XT Nitro Plus graphics card. Sapphire, AMD's most dedicated and trusted graphics card partner, today announced their flagship RX 6900 XT Nitro Plus graphics card with Big Navi GPU. This is the fastest graphics card Sapphire has ever released. The graphics card is a 2.7 slot design with custom configuration of the image output ports, 3x DP plus 1x HDMI. Sapphire has released two variants of the Nitro Plus graphics card for the RX 6800 XT line, the RX 6800 Nitro Plus and Nitro Plus C. The latter has a RGB lighting behind the fans and a USB Type-C connector. The graphics card presented today is the Radeon RX 6900T Nitro Plus, and it is not yet known if Sapphire has plans for an SA variant. The RX 6900 XT Nitro Plus operates at frequencies up to 2050 MHz in gaming mode and 2285 MHz in overclocking mode. These frequencies are not record highs and Sapphire may want to have a headroom for other models such as the Toxic which has been rumored for a long time. The graphics card is powered by two 8-pin connectors, which is quite unusual considering that almost all non-reference RX 6900 XT cards introduced to date have three power connectors. In fact, the two 8-pin PEG connectors combined with the PKI Gen 4 interface are capable of delivering up to 375 watts of power. The power consumption of this card is set at 340W by default, so the buyer can overclock his video card a little more if he wants. Sapphire recommends an 850W PSU for this card. Potential buyers should note that the length of the graphics card is 31cm. Of course, this is not the largest custom card released in the last few months, but it is definitely not small and may simply not fit into a computer case. At the moment, Sapphire has not announced how much the Radeon RX 6900 XT Nitro Plus will cost, however, since the manufacturer's suggested retail price for the AMD card is $999, the cost of the presented product will definitely exceed $1000 for Evergreen Notes.